Hi, this is Michael from Southern Fire Guitars, and these are the Quarantine Files. I've been asked by a few people to give a lesson on this little tune that I sometimes play in my videos. I'm going to play that tune now, and then I'm going to show you just how I play it. Let's go now to the Jam Cave. guitar tuned to an open G. That's G, D, G. But you can play this song in any open tuning where you have a root on the bottom and a root on the top. G, G. I am playing through this little Vox Mini 5 rhythm amp right there. Um, I'm on a clean channel with a little bit of reverb on it. And I'm playing with a cordless guitar transmitter right there. And I'm going to show you how to play that tune. I brought the camera a little closer so you could see the fretboard of my fingers a little, little easier. And this tune starts off, I'll play it one time a little closer so you can kind of see it. I'll do it a little slower. Now what you do first in this tune right here is I'm hitting the low G string first and then I'm hitting the seventh fret on the high G the last string so it goes like this that's how it starts off first two notes and then on the last string I go from the seventh fret to the fourth fret then to the second fret What I'm doing with my pick hand, I'm hitting the low string first between each of the other notes, like this. But to get that real thumpy sound, I'm also taking my hand right here, my palm, and I'm muting it onto my bridge. So it kind of mutes the strings, so it's more like this. my index finger on the 4th fret and my pinky on the 7th fret. But you can use your ring finger also. That's the first little part of the tune. Well now when you get down to this note here, the 2nd fret on the last string, this part, Right there it does one of these. So I'm going from the second fret to the fourth fret and then doing a pull off. Pulling off from here to here and then from here to here pulling off. second string and you're doing a hammer on onto your second fret second string and then you're hitting the last string one more time so all 
together, it does. It sounds like this. up from right there, right here. Then you're going to hit your low string one more time. You, know, you basically hit the low string between every note. Kind of gives like almost like a bass line. Now there comes a little chord progression. Where you take your middle finger and it's on the third fret middle string your index finger is on the second fret last string just like this and you're playing the bottom string just open then you're taking the next note is you take your index finger off this note here second string here, uh, second fret, then remove this finger, and then open. string, uh, third fret, and you just go, so it goes, the whole thing slow, It sounds good during this chord progression here. If you can do those notes, arpeggio. I know what some of you are thinking. What the hell is that? Arpeggio is when you're playing the notes individually. I'll show you that close up. Now when I play that part, arpeggio, I'm going from the top string down to the bottom, and then doing it again. guitar videos, lessons, building tips, anything to do with cigar box guitars, please click the subscribe button below and don't forget to like and share this video. My name is Michael and don't forget to check out some of my other videos at the end of this one.